Halt! Oh, blimey, is that you, Witcher? They say you killed the king. Well, I didn't. And I'm going to prove it. I'm inclined to believe you. Glad to hear that. It'd be pretty stupid if I had to kill you now. Did all the Reavers survive the assault? Aye. They've been drinking themselves silly for two days now. I believe I owe you something. You don't owe me a thing. We wound up in a boiling cauldron during the assault. You know how it is when knights get caught in a tight passage. Nowhere to go. Those in the back push forward. Those in the front are stuck. And halberd blows raining down from above. I'd have been crushed if not for my armor. And about ten blows landed on my helmet. My ears still ring and I puke time and again. But I live and breathe. Concussion. It'll pass. Were you on patrol with the Reavers when they ran into those Scoia'tael? Aye. Kennet mentioned the unit was especially vicious. Notice anything out of the ordinary? A unit emblem or something? Write you up. They had masks made of the cloth of Special Forces uniforms. And they hollered a lot. Yorvath or some such. Where did the dragon come from? I've no idea, but it saved our asses. The elves ceased shooting at the sight of it. I can't tell you anymore, as we fled right then as if the devil himself was on our tail. Take this. Kenneth told me to study up, but I've not the mind for it. Just not cut out to be a dragon hunter, I guess. It could be useful to you, though. I need to go. There are sentries on the dike. No way you'll slip through. Can you distract them? Um, I'll try. But remember, count me out if there's a fight. In fact, we could end up foes. I hope not. Go. Just give me a minute. The Kingslayer's escaped! We need to cut him off! Follow me! All right! Let's go! Over here! Bloody hell, you didn't have to torch the castle. It wasn't mine to torch. The castle's lord and master did that, without any help from me. Triss, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. People say what they think they have to. I know, but... They'll change their minds as soon as we find the Kingslayer. Roach will see to that. Right, spy? I'm no spy, but you're mostly correct. An interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel rule Temeria now, or strive to. But no one save old Natalis can restore true order. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown's simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand. Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. Triss. Yes? I'm a bit beat up. Will you look at my wounds? Mm-hmm. Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Prepare to cast off. Clear the lines and all aboard. Lines clear, Captain. Honor's a curious thing. Honor made Arian fight a mismatched battle against the might of Temeria. Facing defeat, Honor told Arian to bow his neck to save his men. But that same honor prevented him from saving himself.
Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known the Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, as water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with a sorceress named Yennefer. Stories of a life stolen from him. Am I boring you? Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special's about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. Sheath your sword, Elf. I'm here to talk. Bow low. You stand before a head crowned. That of Demavand, King of Edirn, by the grace of the gods. Sovereign of the Pontar Valley, and so on. And you are? A friend to non-humans. I have an offer. Speak quickly and to the point. The Arrakis will soon return, and I'd rather know all before then. I can add several more heads to this one. Each crown. Go on. Fault has to start with. I barely escaped in Edirn. I'll need help. Access to your hideouts and maps of your secret trails. And the support of the Scoia'tael. I want no gold and have no interest in the killer's fame. Then why do you wish them dead? It's a long story. Your beast nabbed his necker. Time to go. Do we have a deal, Elf?
Flotsam should be just beyond the point. We'll take the beach. Who's we? You and me. Reconnaissance. I'm coming too. You should stay behind. We can't be sure of the reception we'll get. Precisely why I won't let you go alone. Someone's got to look after you. That time of the month. Any news from your secret informer? The port's blocked. Some merchants have been held up for months. What about roads through the forest? Yorveth rules the forest. Where are we? In a forest? Very funny. But who does it belong to? Yorleth, maybe? I know more about the Pontar Valley than you think. For instance, I know that Foltest stole this land from Demavend a few years back. I believe you had a hand in that? Foltest had just as much right to this land as Demavend. Right? Or do you mean might? Hear that? I smell an elf. That's Vernon Roach, Special Forces Commander for the last four years, servant of the Temerian King, responsible for the pacification of the Mahakaman foothills, hunter of elves, murderer of women and children, twice decorated for valor on the field of battle. Yorveth, a regular son of a whore. I've long awaited our meeting. Laid plans, set traps, and now you appear in my forest of your own volition. You aided the man who slew my king. King or beggar, what's the difference? One dwan less. Where's your unit? Dispersed by a raiding party? They're exactly where they should be. I assure you, no humans can surprise the Squirtel. We need him alive. Know any useful spells? Get his attention. I need to focus. I'll try. Climb down and we'll finish this. I await. Ha! <laughs> You're a man without honor, Vernon Roach. An insect I'll not duel, but one that I will crush. Seems like you spout the same old elven drivel. What do you mean, Witcher? I've seen your kind before. Proud and shay, sneaking around forests. Helpless, yet masking that with acts of increasing cruelty. I helped kill Roach's king. You call that helpless? Or would you call me a terrorist? No one will grant us our freedom, Witcher. We must win it for ourselves. Since when did the Scoia'tael hire professional killers to do their dirty work? The Dewan, even. You've fallen low. A hired killer, true. But in all certainty, he is no Dewan. Don't make a big deal of the race thing. Yet race is the very reason we fight. We have pointed ears, yours are rounded. We are few yet long-lived. Your kind multiplies like vermin, though thankfully expires quickly. Humans and elves alike, trying to prove one shape is better than the other. 400 years of killing over the mold of the Oracle. The Kingslayer's among you. We've come for him. Then our interests collide. The Kingslayer is under my protection, and I'll not hand over a guest. You're just another old elf in a young elf's skin, using clever words to mask an obvious truth. Obvious, you say? This is not about race or freedom, or even vengeance. 
You're here because someone powerful told you to be. Someone who's using you. They may wear a crown, carry a magic wand, or even lead a guild. But be sure of this. It's not about your freedom, your rights, or your ears. Nilfgaard plowed you once. Now someone new does. Am I wrong? Those times are gone. No one will ever use the Square Tal again. Who are you addressing? Me? Yourself? Or the archers in those shrubs? Triss, now! Oh. <laughs> 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 Discourage them. Triss, are you alright? Lovely. You should have charmed the archers. They're coming. Geralt, the spell's still working. Stay close. Back to the boat? There's even more of them that way. We must fight our way toward Fluxer. Mm -hmm. oh, 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 Who did you think it was? I'm not a sack of flour or one of your commandos. I'm a woman. I know it is. <laughs> At least I'll die holding a lovely ass. Not mine. I'll hold the spell. Come on, let's go. Stop shaking. I need to focus. Are you all right? Yes. Fine. Sons of bitches. What's happening? All I see are your boots. Where the hell is that trading post? I'm starting to think we'll make it. Wait. The barrier's waiting. Trace. Be quick! Give me a bit more magic. Just a little. Geralt, kill them now! Squirrel salad sacking! Alarm! Squirrels! There's a mage among them! Ready yourselves! You know each other? Rather well. But he has amnesia. I actually took the Witcher by surprise when I killed Foltest. Fear not, Elf. I know Geralt. I know his weakness. Too many spells at once. You can die from that. See that? Yeah. The Kingslayer and Yorvith. You all in one piece? Who are you? I'm a witcher. Emmy of R. Emrys, spice merchant. A trader? In spices. Uh-huh. I'm the woman. My good man, we barely escaped death. Be so kind as to tell us where we might get some rest. We'll explain everything later. Very well. Head for the market square. You might be in time for the execution. Some ne'er-do-wells are going to hang. A dwarf and some bard. There's also an inn and a brothel. Oh yeah, the brothel sounds especially interesting. Take care now. Spice merchant. Not like Did it. you say that? Squirrels are all very wolves. Yorveth led them. I saw them with my own eyes. 
Who are these blokes? They're the ones the elves were chasing. Assault in broad daylight. <laughs> well, I, I see think you the stew's ready. Why, it ah, some artists at work. A bunch of you might want to stir it. Spy. I don't heard stir. the spies cowardly. I work the You're material. Really think he'll shit himself? <laughs> Zoltan. Dandelion. My former. Just great. What's the plan? We improvise. No killing. We'll take care of this, Triss. Geralt! Geralt! Over here! Help! Step back, white one. What are they going to hang for? They don't look dangerous. The charge is collusion with a sky or two. Dandelion and elven spy? The bard's hanging for debauchery. What? The sentence was he's to hang for debauchery. And a sentence is nothing to scoff at! Are you serious? Listen here, people. Is profligacy now a punishable offense in the free kingdom of Tamaria? Or are we in Nilfgaard? A piss off, freak! Or you'll have me to deal with. Think of the common folk, you're spoiling their fun. Well, a freak he may be, but he speaks true. Debauchery is one of my favorite pastimes, but I don't want a noose placed around my neck for pursuing it. The soldier boys paid us a visit or two, though we didn't have much fun. Away with you, Margot! Go back to your brothel! Time to go? Fine. But hear this, people. He sure liked to parade about, but his willy wouldn't come to attention. Ha! <laughs> Stop the execution. Shut your trap. The thing is to hang, and he will hang. This is a decent town. Whores and witches notwithstanding. Watch your words, guardsman! I don't know witches, but Margot's a decent woman! Shut it, all of you! Or I'll not vouch for what I'll do. Thinks he's tough, showing off his balls. Don't fret, people. I've seen the rot on them. <laughs> I'm warning you for the last time, Margo. You wouldn't hit a lady. You're no lady. Careful, hey, witcher. Anyway. Look here, out. Yeah. Assaulted an officer. <laughs> Come on up. Got room for one more deviant. Look here out! Assaulted an officer! You freak! You have to squirm with the others! Come on up! Got room for one more deviant! They'll hang anyway! Come on up! Got room for one more deviant! Yeah! Beat Lucky! Assaulted an officer!
What the hell is going on here? I said, what the arse fuck is going on? Uh, uh, I'd like to re re report. <laughs> Out of my sight, Clover. A few ploughing bandits and you can't even hang them. And you, stay calm. Hands off your sword. Our scaffold embraces speeches and hangings. Which will it be? Your people started it. Short fuses, some of them. What do I care? They started, but you finished. I had to defend my friends. Will you release them? Terrible choice of friends, Witcher. I'd rather give you a thief. Relax. I'm joking. I hate thieves. We can put on another show. Bloody and serious this time, mind you. Or we can come to an understanding. Meaning? Give me a minute, Witcher. Listen here. You may have heard rumours of the tragic events that transpired during the siege of Lavalet Castle. Sadly, they are true. King Foltest is dead. It's likely that Scoyatel had a hand in this heinous murder. So you see, none of you can feel safe. That is why today, wagons with armaments will roll out into Flotsam streets. I hereby declare a state of emergency. Await orders. Prepare to fight. And ready yourselves to avenge your fallen king. Now disperse. Go to your homes. Nice speech. You might as well have said outright that non-humans slew Foltest. My subjects know exactly who the enemy is. Out in that forest, Grow careless for a moment, and you're a dead man. Whereas the non-humans here in town are all friendly. Friendlier than the merciless bastards out there. We let the Scoyatel inside, and they'll skin us alive, just before they slit our throats. Here, even the slightest sense of safety is an illusion. We'll not succumb to it for a moment. What about them? They'll not hang for now. Let's say I'm reconsidering their cases. The scaffold's no place for civil conversation. We'll talk at my home. Your friends are free for the time being, but they're not to leave town. Come after dusk. <laughs> I'll be busy till then. There's one more thing. Welcome to Flotsam, Witcher. They were really going to hang us. I, I, I don't know. I didn't mean to torch that watchtower. Everything's all right, Dandelion. Let's get out of here. Oh, we all. We owe you a get out. Thank you. Time to hit the tavern. Come on, Dandelion, you need a stiff drink. And while we're at it, I'll tell you an edifying tale of local hypocrisy that conceals lechery neath a veneer of courtesy. Except nothing can hide the stench. Hmm, a notice board. Might find something Step interesting lightly, here. boys! But we're not in a hurry! Mouth off like that again, recruit, and by hell I'll thrash you! 